Hi everyone. Hi. Today we are making pecan pie oatmeal. Doesn't have any oats, so don't panic. <laughs> um, but this is going to be really great for people who are over eggs for breakfast, looking for like a warm winter comforting kind of breakfast. Yeah, so it's like a porridge, yeah, isn't it? it is, but, yeah. And it's like sweet and decadent. And you can also do this one dairy free. So if you're avoiding dairy for whatever reason, this is a good option for you. Um, so we've got all of our ingredients here, so I'll just quickly go through them. So we're gonna make it in this saucepan. And in here we have um, some ghee and some sucrine gold. But if you want a dairy-free option, you could use um, coconut oil. I actually found this vanilla bean ghee in the fridge. I was like, huh, that's perfect for that this. Is, yeah. So that's what we're using. Um, and sucre and gold is a brown sugar replacement. So it's stevia and erythritol, and it's like brown sugar. You can get a nat beer one at the supermarket now. We haven't tried that one yet, but you want like that brown sugar kind of gooeyness because that gives the caramelized <clears throat> kind of flavor yes we also have some coconut milk some golden flax meal i really prefer the golden flax meal in this recipe it has a much milder flavor i find it is hard to find the golden one yeah. though i don't think we've found it at the regular supermarket no. i some health igas shop. health food shops um, yeah. or online yeah uh, we've also got some hemp seeds and of course we have to have pecans because it's pecan pie flavored and um, we love pecans they're yeah. probably our favorite nut they are. Um, we're also going to put a bit of nutmeg some cinnamon and a pinch of salt so that is all our ingredients so what we're going to do first is pop our saucepan on the stove and we're going to have the ghee or coconut oil the sweetener and our pecans and we're going to kind of toast the pecans a bit and dissolve the sweetener um, so we'll cook that for a few minutes then we'll add in everything else and the kind of flax meal and the hemp seeds will thicken it up and they make it like the oatmeal texture consistency yeah, yeah. so we just have our ghee our sweetener and our pecans in here we're just going to melt the ghee dissolve the sweetener and toast the nuts we're just going to cook it for a couple of minutes. It smells good. How good does that smell? Yeah. Okay, our sweetener's all dissolved and our nuts have toasted. So I'm just going to add in our coconut milk. And we have our golden flax meal and our hemp seeds, pinch of salt. Cinnamon and some nutmeg. Now we're just gonna give this a stir and cook it for a couple of minutes until it's thickened. Okay, you can see it has thickened up now that and it smells delicious in here. So it smells like pecan pie. <laughs> that is ready. ready. Okay, so our pecan pie oatmeal is ready. So you can also get creative here with any toppings and things that you want to put on it. We've just put a little bit of um, coconut flakes and a little bit of nut butter that we've drizzled on there. Mm -hmm. um, you could top it with some fruit, like some blueberries or some strawberries if you like. Granola. Yep. Yeah, um, we have keto granola. Um, so yeah, there's plenty that you could do with it from here. Or you could is, just eat it as is as well. Yeah, you could definitely just eat it as is. So, we tasting? Yeah, so I don't know if we said at the start, but it is two serves. So we've got one serve in here and then... But you could obviously halve the recipe if you just wanted to make one. Mm. What do you think, That's Dan? yummy. Yeah? Mmm. Getting oatmeal vibes or If porridge? you were someone who liked porridge <laughs> in the winter and you've been missing it, definitely give this a go. Did you want to try that? 
I mean, I don't think it's probably something you want to be having every day because it's got, you know, sweetener and everything in it, but I feel like it would be a nice kind of weekend treat. What do you think? Yeah, it's delicious. It's really like, I think if mm. you didn't use the brown sugar, you would regret it. So definitely try and use mm. like a brown sugar replacement if possible. It um, really reminds me of porridge. How the, the flaxseed and the hemp seeds creates that texture yeah. is pretty amazing, um, but totally delicious. So definitely give this recipe a go. It was pretty easy was, as well. Um, maybe six minutes to make. Like do you think you could get it to the point where you put all of the ingredients in, turn it down low, jump in the shower and then have it? It probably didn't even need that long. No, though. it wasn't long. Yeah. It literally was like... No. Less than five minutes. So. And you could also then just pop this in a um, like a Tupperware container or whatever, and you've got you know you could take it to work. It's portable. I'm sure it would reheat fine. If you've enjoyed this video, make sure you give us a thumbs up for more recipes like this. Make sure you subscribe to our channel, and thank you so much for watching. Bye. Bye.